When performing any experiment, proper management of waste is highly important. When working with acids and bases, separate acidic and basic waste into dedicated acid and base waste beakers. Carefully label each of these beakers so you don't confuse them with each other. Discard of your materials into their respective waste containers. For some experiments, there may be certain materials that should be disposed of separately from other materials. Always consult your instructor if you're unsure of where to dispose of certain materials. Non-volumetric glassware can simply be cleaned with soapy water and a sponge or scrub brush that are provided at the sinks. After your glassware has been properly cleaned, rinse your glassware with deionized water. Volumetric glassware is calibrated in such a way that even scrubbing it could alter the amount of solution that it holds. Therefore, never scrub volumetric glassware. To clean volumetric glassware, simply rinse multiple times with deionized water. If your glassware still won't get clean after rinsing with deionized water, consult your instructor. Volumetric pipettes can be cleaned in a manner very similar to all other volumetric glassware. Using a spray bottle with deionized water, rinse your pipette thoroughly on the inside and the outside. If your pipette is still not clean after thoroughly rinsing, consult your instructor. As with pipettes, burettes should be thoroughly rinsed with deionized water. Again, if your volumetric glassware is not clean after rinsing with deionized water, consult your instructor. Your bench top should be cleaned first with a soap solution. Using a paper towel, scrub the top of your bench. This will remove any acids or bases or other corrosive materials. After wiping your bench top off with soap solution, wipe your bench top off with deionized water.